Hello everyone, it's me again, and I've kept my word. I'm about to have some cookies and milk. In case you're wondering, these are white, <coughs> excuse me, white chocolate macadamia nut cookies. I got my milk. I got myself a cup of coffee. Coffee, yeah. It's decaf, don't worry. And I got myself some water, because I have to admit, sometimes I indulge too much in sugar, and, well, it makes me a little loopy. But that's okay. One Step one towards my recovery begins now. I'm not going to wait until I might win the contest by Rob Dyke. He might not pick me, but I'm not going to wait to begin my recovery until he makes up his mind. I'm going to start right now. The only thing that contest would do for me is make it so that my equipment is better than what I got. Because as you can see, all I've got is my laptop. Now, one thing i got to remember to do is look at the little green light. Because otherwise I'm going to look at myself. Green light. Green light. See, this is what happens when I don't have enough cookies. Excuse me. I can't get the box open. Ah! Cookie. Now, while I indulge in this here cookie, I want to share a couple of steps with you that I intend to take. And I'm going to take them tonight, even after you, before or after you watch this video, it makes no difference. First of all, it's better to have a short term list than green light than a long term list. Green light. Uh, my short-term list starts with beginning a recovery page for Facebook and reaching out to the world so I can hear their stories and they'll hear my stories and we'll all get together like a big family and work on helping each other out. Okay? Because I watched this really awesome story about a guy named Arthur who was helped by uh, Diamond Dallas Page. And this guy went from walking on crutches, he was overweight, he lost all that weight, and he doesn't use crutches anymore. If you want to watch that story, I'll post it in the link below in the description. Anyway, green light. <laughs> Damn it. Keep forgetting about the green light. Okay, now. Uh, so I'm going to start with that. And I'm going to have another cookie. And I'm going to remember to watch the green light have some coffee, and then I'm going to write myself a story. Now, the best thing you got to understand, when you, if, you, if you're interested in writing at all, write for yourself, okay? Don't, don't try to impress anybody with your writing skills, because there's always going to be some asshole out there who's going to point out everything that's wrong with your work. Yes, and that frustrated me for a long time. For a long, long time. But from now on, the story's done when I say it's done. It's my story. Okay? And my story's not done. I have several fictional stories I want to write. Some are nonfiction. Sometimes it's about me. Sometimes it's about the people around me. Whatever. Write. That's one of my, uh, it's a, oh my god, it's a big, big tension reliever when you can actually put together a story okay it helps a great deal now writing happens to be a passion of mine one that has faltered over the years because of being depressed because of being an alcoholic and all that crappy nonsense but now that I'm taking a stand okay because I have heroes out there and uh, you probably hopefully you're watching this video I know I'm kind of chubby I mean, like, I know I'm kind of chubby, but who cares? Okay, because over time, I'm going to change all that. But my point of this video, and I'm babbling, I'm sorry I'm babbling. It's just it's just because I'm excited. Because I know I'm going to do well. And no one is going to stop me. The only person that can stop me is me. Okay? Where was I? Oh, yeah. Cookie. Green light. Short-term steps. I'm going to make a recovery page for Facebook. 
I'm going to write more stories. I'm going to post them on a beautiful site known as Wattpad. Okay? That's where the writer decides when his, his or her story is done. Okay? You write your stories your way. If you like to read other people's stories or just write more of your own, you don't need a system. Not really. You write that stuff down any way you see fit. When you read it, are you happy with it? That's what's important. Now, there is many, there are many other different ways towards enlightenment, towards recovery. Uh, my biggest demon is alcohol. But I've done other stuff. I've tried meth. I've done heroin, if you can believe that. I only did it for like three months. But three months was too long. Because I was dumb enough to end up with hepatitis C. Yes, you heard me correctly. Alright? And I'll tell you that story another time. It's way too depressing right now. Yes, I will make a video about how I got hep C. But let me tell you, hepatitis C and alcoholism, they are not friends. Sooner or later, it's going to kill me. And I'm not going to let that happen. Okay? But we'll discuss that later. Right now, I'm just telling you my plans while I'm cookie I have not bitten yet. I'm telling you my pl green light. Damn it. Look at the green light. I'm acting a fool. You know why I'm acting a fool? Because I'm sober as hell. Now as you can see this video is not going to perk anybody's day with my own self-indulgence with sugar and milk. <laughs> I'm acting a fool. And you know what? I promise my next videos will make a lot of sense. Right now, people are going to look at this video and go, man, there's something wrong with this dude, man. He's whacked out of his mind. Sometimes people are so miserable in their lives that when they come across real happiness, they don't have a clue what to do with it. I am that guy. <laughs> I don't have a fucking clue what to do with being happy. But I'm going to learn it, and you're coming along with me if you can get past my weirdness in this particular video. If you've watched my previous videos, clearly you see I was a pretty depressing, sad motherfucker. Well, I'm tired of that. I'm tired of it. I'm sick of it. You understand? We got an old saying in AA, I'm sick and tired of being sick and tired. Well, I'm sick and tired of hearing about other people being sick and tired of me being sick and tired. I believe it and all that bullshit. Made no sense, right? Good. Stick with me anyway, and I'll help you get there because I'm on my way of getting there myself to happiness. True, absolute happiness. Okay? I'm sorry if this video is a little too kooky for you, but, well, get over it because I'm already over it. Now, if you'll excuse me, I'm going to finish this cookie. I'll come back later with more details, and I'll be a lot calmer, I swear. Green light. Alright y'all, catch you later.